One story so many of you are still talking about is the whale that washed up on shore on Long, Se Long Sands Beach in York on Friday night. Viewers sent us photos from the 25 foot long mink whale washed up on shore, but there's a claim circulating on social media that this whale did not die of natural causes. To find out if there's any truth to the claim, we reached out to the experts in marine mammal protection. Let's verify. The pictures are stunning. A 25 foot long minka whale stranded on the shore of Long Sands Beach in York on Friday night. In the comments on social media, people are claiming that wind farms are responsible for this whale's death. The issue gained traction earlier this year when 16 humpback whales washed up on Atlantic Ocean shores this winter. So let's verify. Is there any evidence that wind farms are responsible for killing whales? Our sources are. Marine Mammals of Maine, the agency that recovered the whale, the Marine Mammal Commission, an independent scientific agency that advises the federal government on policies that could impact marine mammals, the U.S. government's Bureau of Ocean Energy Management, and NOAA Fisheries. Marine Mammals of Maine posted an update on its Facebook page on Saturday. It says the whale was in extremely poor nutritional condition. Those marine scientists say the animal stranded itself in poor health. They say while their team was responding to the scene, the whale died. They say, quote, the necropsy team is still working to complete the evaluation, and it may take an extensive amount of time for samples to be processed and more details to become available. Some argue the noise from offshore wind farms can impact a whale's navigation and lead to stranding or death. But our sources say there's no evidence to support that theory. The Marine Mammal Commission, the Bureau of Ocean Energy Management, and NOAA Fisheries all say there's no evidence to link these strandings to offshore wind energy development, nor is there evidence linking noise from site surveys causing the death of whales. NOAA has been tracking the increase in whale deaths over the last six years and determined that vessel strikes and entanglement in fishing gear are the greatest human threats to large whales. So we can verify no. There's no evidence that wind farms are responsible for killing whales. As always, if there's something you'd like us to verify, you can email us at verify at newcentermain.com or reach out to us on social media.